and even as we get in this time of worship god god i ask god that you your presence just fill this place god that we are able and we are just able to clear our hearts and minds god and just be in the secret place with you where it's just you and us god and no one else and nothing else god is just us talking to you just talking to you about our lives talking to you about the things happening god and just building our relationship with you god just growing deeper in our relationship with you just growing stronger in our faith and our trust in you god god i come at this time of worship into your hands in jesus name amen let's sing the first song it's called blessed be your name We can all put our hands together. Let's give thanks to God for all that He's done this week. Come on. Blessed be your name in the land that is plentiful, where streams of abundance flow. Blessed be your name. Blessed be your name when found in the desert place, the walk to the wilderness. Blessed be your name. Can we sing blessed be your name again? Blessed be your name, in the land that is plentiful, the streams of abundance flow. Blessed be your name. Blessed be your name, we found in the desert place, the home to the wilderness. Blessed be your name. Every blessing. Every blessing you pour out on, I turn back to pray. When the darkness closes in, Lord, still I will stay. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Blessed be your name.
Blessed be the name of the Lord. The blessed be your glorious name. Blessed be your name of the Lord. Blessed be your name. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Blessed be your glorious name. this time God and even as we continue with this time of worship God, we bring our worship to you today we bring our prayer to you today God in this place that where it's just you and us and I speak against all the distractions in our mind that's causing us to be so distracted and not fully focused, God, on you. God, I ask that you just bring us this peace where we are able to just worship and come as we are and just worship in this secret place with you, God. I want 
You split the sea so I 
find ourselves in front of the sea like the Israelites did where the sea is in the front of us and the armies at the back of us if we find ourselves in a situation like that in our lives today you know I just want to pray over our lives today where like God came through for the Israelites in a way beyond they could imagine in the way beyond they could comprehend that God will come through for you today just the same way that he did where he will give you that strength and that grace to just walk through the sea like it was nothing because it's not our, us it's not our efforts it's nothing that our mind can comprehend or imagine and for us it might seem impossible but there's nothing impossible for our God There's nothing that he cannot do to make an impossible, completely out of, out of human, just, we cannot even imagine, just unseen, to create a certain impossible situation and turn it in our lives and make it possible for us. Because that's how great our God is.
sing that one more time. last song God that we have God I thank you God for just how amazing you are and just how you come through for us all the time God like you've done before for us that you've always been there for us God and that you will continue being there for us, God. And that there's nothing that compares to your greatness, God. And there's nothing that compares the time that we get to spend with you, God, and building our relationship with you, God. In that secret place, God, where it's just you and us, God, and nothing else and no one else, God. Where we can bring what we cannot even talk about what we cannot even pray about but you can know what's in our hearts today God as we come to you in that place God as we bring our hearts desire to you God our hearts prayer to you that you see right through and through us God God speak to us as we sing the song today In Jesus' name, amen.
that we have in you God and whatever we came in you today with God we just bring it to you God whatever that was disturbing us whatever that is a hindrance for us today God we bring it to you God and we don't just talk about it we don't just think about it God but we pray over it God we pray over our lives, God. We pray over that any, any obstacle that we came in here today, that we walk out without that, God. That we walk out with a prayer answered by you, God. Because, God, we, don't, we won't fear. We don't, won't feel what's happening in our lives, God. We won't, cause, we won't let it cause 
anxiety God we won't let it cause us stress God but instead we will pray about it God and we will talk about we will talk to the problem God and we will declare your promises over it God we'll declare your promises over our lives God today because nothing God nothing compares to your promises that you spoken over our lives God even before we were born even when we were in our mother's wombs God now you've spoken those promises over our lives God that we don't need to live in fear God but we can live with a peace that passes all understanding God because we know that we walk through those promises God that we walk with faith in your word God that when your word is uh, their words are living God when we speak your words God there's a change that happens God when we speak your words when we speak and declare your promises God and let's not just stop today as we leave or as we even continue with this man that the rest of the service or as we leave but let's keep praying and let's keep declaring God's promises over our lives as we go through this week Because there's nothing that compares to God's promise over our lives. We come at the rest of service, God, into your hands as well. That you speak to us in a way that we need to hear from you, God. In Jesus' name, amen.